Overview, the origin of life. The general theory of evolution states that all living things came from a single cell and that the first cell originated from something like a primordial soup. However, this same chemical theory has been tested repeatedly in perfect laboratory conditions for decades without success. Random chemical reactions can only produce random chemical molecules and nothing more critical for life to begin. In chemistry, the reactions to get the necessary chemical reactions go in the opposite way to what is required to get life from non-living chemicals. In addition, any chemist attempting this experiment is highly unlikely to use water, as water destroys the bonds faster than they can form. But any primordial soup would inevitably have had water in it, so this would be the last place you would expect proteins or DNA to form randomly. The simplest possible life form, the cell, is and has always been incredibly complex. The very simplest possible living thing would have to have over 350 enzymes to work, and each enzyme is made up of a very precise sequence of amino acids. The random chance of this happening would be the same as guessing a 5,000 digit pin for the first time round. It simply could not happen. Information, communication and language are required for life but they only come from intelligent sources. The information in the DNA requires enzymes to read it, but the instructions to build those enzymes are on the DNA. This is a real chicken and egg problem for the evolutionary theory, as DNA and the enzymes would have had to appear at the same time. Everything known today about chemistry, genetics, physics, probability, information theory and linguistics all argue against the possibility of the spontaneous origin of life.
The Origin of Life Summary The simplest possible life form is still incredibly complex. Biomolecules do not come from random chemical reactions. The difference between living and non-living things is not so much the substances they contain, but how these substances are intelligently organised. The so-called RNA world is very unstable and scientifically unrealistic for life to begin. Everything known today about chemistry, genetics, physics, probability, information theory and linguistics all argue against the possibility of the spontaneous origin of life. The living cell functions by an interdependence where one part depends on another. Information, communication and language are required for life, but only come from an intelligent source. The possibility of life forming by itself from non-living matter is impossible.